I mean, Mark talks in Pig's report. What are your, some of your expectations, or what do you expect the report to show in terms of um, breeding herd and market hogs? Well, uh, I haven't crunched the numbers on it yet, but I, my expectations based on where sow slaughter has been is that we've moved this breeding herd pretty much sideways over the Christmas, over the uh, the winter uh, season. Uh, it grew a little bit from September to, to December. Uh, I think that was some people looking at, uh, you know, that was before feed prices went up dramatically, and so uh, we got a little bit of growth last fall. I don't think that's continued this year, this winter. We've been slaughtering about normal rates of slaughters as relative to the size of the U.S. breeding herd if we just take U.S. hogs and back the Canadians out. So I think we're going to be sideways on, on that. I wouldn't ex wouldn't be surprised to see uh, the market herd up slightly, but very very little. I, mean, I don't see much change in this thing at this point. So I wouldn't I wouldn't look for any numbers that are significantly different from a year ago uh, when we get there. Uh, the one to watch is going to be farrowing intentions for the April June quarter. I thought those were kind of low in the December per, uh, report relative to the size of the breeding herd, so there could be some revision there. And of course. The litter size had returned to 2% growth oh, year over year in December after being a little less than 2% for a couple of quarters, and uh, that's going to be a key number, and I wouldn't be surprised to see it stay at 2% or better.